signs and ways that you might have abandoned the Qur'an. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us. The first is Hajru Tilawa, that you abandon the Tilawa of the Qur'an, that you stop reciting the Qur'an altogether. All and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us. Ibn Abbas radiallahu anhu says, Man lam Quran fi shahrin faqad hajara. Whoever does not read the Qur'an within one month has completely abandoned it. The second is abandoning its memorization. Today we see a lot of people that are memorizing stupid songs, memorizing dumb TikTok dances, memorizing empty things. And they're not spending any time trying to memorize the work, book of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Does that sound familiar? The third is abandoning its tadabbur. That you stop thinking about the words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. What Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is trying to tell you in his word, in his book. Right? You just don't think about what's being said or who's being talked to and what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is trying to tell you in this story. The fourth is abandoning it in action. That you don't live the Qur'an or the verses of the Qur'an that you're trying to memorize and you're living with. Some people might recite the Qur'an, but the Qur'an is actually cursing them. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala doesn't like any of those who are arrogant. And the person reading it is the most arrogant. And the last is, is the judgment. Haram is haram, halal is halal. If you pick and choose what fits you, that's not Islam to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That's whatever I want. And that's not our deen.